Welcome. This tutorial demonstrates how to create a Dropbox in Zythos. Zythos Dropbox automates the process of submitting documents. It is a safe and secure way for users to upload or submit files for review, such as proposals, bids, expense reports, and homework assignments. In addition, the Dropbox administrators can define who is allowed to submit documents to the Dropbox and how long the Dropbox remains open for submissions. A new Dropbox is created by selecting the new Dropbox icon in Document Manager. Once the Dropbox has been created, it is saved in Zythos to a folder which you specify and can be identified by the Dropbox icon. Using a sample Dropbox created for receiving project bids, I will first show you how a Dropbox administrator manages the Dropbox and second, how a submitter can upload a document to the Dropbox. A Dropbox is opened by double-clicking on the Dropbox icon. The Dropbox administrator defines who is allowed to submit documents to the Dropbox and for what period of time. Click on the Manage button to change these settings. Under Details, the administrator has the option to change the Dropbox title, description, and auto open and close dates. Click on Submitters. Here, the administrator defines whom may submit files to the Dropbox. A user who is submitting a file cannot see other users who are participating in the submission process or their files. Under Administrators, you may assign multiple users to be administrators of the Dropbox. The web view of the Dropbox enables the Dropbox administrator to view and manage the submitted files. Once a file is submitted to a Dropbox, it cannot be deleted or changed by the submitter. Only the Dropbox administrator has the ability to delete and move submitted files. As an administrator, you may move submitted files to other folders in Zythos, or you may delete any or all of the submitted files. A filter is available to help you more easily locate the documents you are looking for. You may filter the files in the Dropbox according to the user who has submitted the file or by submission date and time. Refresh the web view and all filters will be cleared and new document submissions will be displayed. The administrator may also manually close or open the Dropbox for submissions. You may notify submitters that you have created and shared this Dropbox with them by sending them an email with a link to the Dropbox. Exit the Dropbox by closing the browser window. Next, let's look at how an individual submits a document to the Dropbox. The Dropbox web view for the submitter is simple. It displays a list of files submitted by the user and provides the option to either upload or copy files into the Dropbox. Once a file is submitted to a Dropbox, it cannot be deleted or changed by the submitter. Submitting documents to the Dropbox is easy. In summary, the Zythos Dropbox automates the process of submitting documents. It is a safe and secure way for users to upload files for review, such as proposals, bids, expense reports, and homework assignments. Thank you for taking the time to find out more about Zythos.